All right, my friends, yours truly, Rock and Dave, the real deal. North Fort Myers, Southwest Florida, and I'm going to make this uh, as quick as I possibly can. This is a respond to um, one of my new subscribers here, and thank you for subscribing. Uh, MTBT Texas Bike Rider had a question on one of my last videos on um, my melodies and, and my picking, my picking technique. And uh, I think part of it was the muting technique, like with some of the chords I'm doing. So, here is how I'm doing my, my hand. What I'm doing is I rest my hand on the palm of my hand on the, on the bridge here. And um, so you get this. I don't even see this. I just muted enough. If you have problems with the upstroke, this is perfect for the upstroke. Just do this. Just practice it nice and make it make it melodic so this way you won't uh, get frustrated by trying to go fast so that's how I do that now a lot of times when I am playing my uh, muted uh, melody lines it's the same thing sometimes my hand fans out a little bit if I'm doing like Sometimes it'll do that. Sometimes it's, I, it's unconscious. You know, I'm, I'm not really aware of it. Uh, when I do my picking exercise, I'll, I'll cuff my hand. But the reality is, is that, you know, look at how the left paw is. Sometimes it'll bevel down. So sometimes I'll try to brace my hand on, you know, the ring casing and for the uh, pickup. Or I try to be careful on the, the body because my nails will scratch. And the reason why I have nails is another reason why my hand will do that. Is when I'm playing classical and flamenco guitar, my hand is arched like this, and if I'm doing so, I hope this is helpful for everyone out there. Just take your time. Everyone.